guys, welcome back to my channel today. I hope y'all are having a really great day. Uh, there's little Moo Moo. Say hello, Moo Moo. Okay, I'm giving them a second chance. Front door fashion. Okay, my last box was, you know, there were some cute pieces, but it really just was not me. Um, so I requested a new stylist, talked to her on the phone, and these are the things I told her. Um, I told her that, you know, luckily Front Door Fashion is in Texas. They're actually headquartered in Dallas, and so they understand Texas weather. So I said, you know, I'm in Texas, layers are good, because, um, you know, when it starts to get, it's cold in the morning, but then it warms up in the afternoon. So we might need to layer in the morning, but then we need to start shedding those layers, you know, come afternoon. Told her about my trip, you know, I said, I'm really pretty set for my trip, but you know, if there's something really super special that I love, then I might take it with me. Um, you know, and the weather keeps changing, you guys. Uh, a couple weeks ago when we were planning the trip and kind of thinking about what we were going to pack, it was supposed to be super, super cold. Now, the week we're going to be there, the first part of the week is going to be actually pretty mild. A couple of the days, the highs are going to be in the 60s. So I've got to totally revamp what I'm taking. The second part of the trip, when we're actually at the retreat, it is going to be very cold, but we're going to be inside most of the time. So anyway, but enough about that. But anyway, so um, I told her, you know, consider layers. And then I told her um, I don't like anything fitted, especially around the tummy area. I'm super self-conscious about my tummy, um, especially my lower tummy. You know what I mean? So I don't like short tops that come up, you know, not even like a crop top, and that would be a definite no, but even just a short top that's going to show that, you know, show that part of my tummy. It's just, just my problem area, you guys. Um, told her the fabrics that I did not like. Uh, she was really sweet, sweet, sweet girl. And so, I'm hoping that I have better luck with this one. So front door fashion, the way it works is you don't pay a styling fee. You use a credit card and you put a $100 deposit down. Um, whatever you keep, they take it out of that $100. Most of their pieces range around $100, although I've gotten quite a few that were under $100 in my last box, you know, around the $60, $70 mark, so that was good. Um, there is no like big discount. I think, um, I'm trying to think. If you keep a certain amount, you get a percentage off, but I don't even think so. Now, we do have a referral link, and if you use my referral link, you'll get $50, I believe, off your first box, and then I'll get $50 off my next box, I think is how it works. Um, anyway, I'll put all the information down in the description box. All right, comes in this really big box. It's really kind of cool, too. Um, it's not a subscription, so you don't have to worry about skipping a box or anything like that. Um, you're not going to get a box every month. It's going to come only when you request it, kind of like fashion. All right. Comes in, oh my, comes in a hang-up bag. Um, this box, I, when I picked it up, it was not near as heavy as my first box. My first box was so heavy, I could hardly lift it. All right, here's the card. This, this is good. This will give us all the information that I couldn't remember. So, hold on. Y'all, I got my nails done for my trip, and I did something different. Um, you know, I've been doing, hang on, that's, that's loud. I've been doing, like, a, a French tip, you know, white tip kind of manicure, and this time I decided to go really neutral, almost a nude polish. What do y'all think? Y'all like that? It's kind of a pinky nude. I like it, and then I, I went a little longer with the nails. These are not my real nails. They had to they had to put tips on, but I think they look pretty. My daughters were so creative. We all went together. My daughter, Jenny, who y'all have met, uh, she's the art teacher. Hers are like, every other one is like black and then candy corn and then maybe another design. I don't know. So stinking cute. And then my daughter, Casey, that y'all have met, hers, she did an ombre effect. So like she, five different colors. So she started with a light color and then, was it light? No, she started with a dark color and then it got lighter, lighter, lighter. And then her ring finger was a glittery color, all in the fall colors. And I was like... I'm so boring, <laughs> but I like them. They turned out really pretty. Okay, so here's your return um, label. Put everything back in the uh, hang-up bag. Put it back in the box. You know, they give you tape strips to tape it up. 
I always use box tape because I'm always afraid it's not going to hold. Um, and then you take it to a FedEx drop off. All right. And then here is your, they send them in like little bundles. Like you get, um, what do they call them? Yeah. Oh, well, this one's got outfit one, outfit two, outfit three, and outfit four. <laughs> yeah, y'all, this is okay. So the total of this box is $1,065. Mm -hmm. If I keep everything in the box, <laughs> I'm sorry, I get tickled at that. I would love to see a YouTuber that kept everything in the box. Then you get 10% off $106. So it would come down to $958.50. There's 12 items in here. Wow, that's substantially less. The last box I got, I had 20 items. Um, I would, you can uh, bring on the perks. It says keep five items and you receive $20 in perk credit toward your next purchase. So if I chose five things, I'd get 25, I'd get $20 off my next box. If I spend 500, I get 50 bonus points. It just, yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's, it's a little more expensive box. I'm not going to do this every month. And I know y'all are thinking, wow, you just did one and now you're doing another one. I wanted to give it a second shot to decide if I'm going to do it. And if I decide to do it, I'm probably only going to do it every few months because it's a lot of stuff. Okay. Uh, try on your outfits. I think you have five days. Give feedback. Da, 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 da. There we go. All right. So, the way I'm going to do this, somebody suggested that I use a uh, clothing rack to do this. Well, I don't have one. But I do have a little hook on the back of this door. So, I think I'm going to try to hang some things back there, and then I'll just show them to you as we go. All right, let, let's just let's just try it and see what happens. Okay, guys, the hook was way too high, so that's not going to work. So here's how it comes. There's my goodies in there. They're grouped together. Look, I'm going to show you. See the little rubber bands? So that's one grouping. Yeah, I have four groupings. Four groupings. All right, so I'm going to take them out. I'm gonna to try to hang them over here on this little, I'm try to hang them right here on this little thing for the closet. I hope I don't break it. <laughs> and that way I can just pull them down and show y'all. Hold on. Okay, I have got them all hanging there and I'm holding my first, holding my first grouping. It's two separate outfits. It's uh, very soft. I don't know what that fabric is. It's that, you know, the little crossover kind of look there. And it looks like I've got some black jeans. I try them on, you guys. I will give you prices and try to be a little bit more specific about brands. This has got my name written all over it. <laughs> it's a shacket. Y'all, that is really cute. Look at the colors. The greens, the browns. Yeah, that's cute. It's by Beach Lunch Lounge. And then this next one is by Gentle Fawn. I love the color. I love the color of this top. That's really cute, y'all, but it looks really short. Next grouping. Uh, this top is just by itself. That looks really big. It's Michael Stars. That, I don't know. I can't, it's kind of a dolman maybe? I don't know. And it's like a, almost looks, um, what am I trying to say? Snake skin. Yeah, it's real soft. Okay, this one is by Veronica M, the same as that green one. It's almost got a little bit of a mineral wash or tie-dye kind of thing. Looks like it's gonna be real fitted around the tummy. And then these pants, <laughs> hold on. These pants look velvet. They're velvet joggers. Like velvet cargo. Or maybe not velvet, maybe just a really fine corduroy. <laughs> but either way, you never know. I may love them. Okay, these next two pieces, um, they're kind of my style. This is definitely, you know, kind of a me thing. Uh, but I actually have a top like this already. So, I don't need this. This is by Velvet Heart. It's soft. It's like a really lightweight flannel. And then I love this. It's 
very thin, very soft. It's by The Line. Um, super soft V-neck sweater. And then the pants, I can't tell what the pants are. The pants are black. They've got a tie at the top. The fabric is interesting. Let's see if you can see it. Um, it's almost um, textured. I don't know. Uh, the fabric's interesting. I'm, I'm excited to see what that fabric's like. All right, and the last bundle, I'm be honest, I don't understand. M maybe it's just meant to be separate. I don't think it's meant to be an outfit. I'm undoing the rubber bands. Hold on. I guess it's a tunic. I'm going to put it over some leggings. It looks kind of long. Well, maybe it's just supposed to be a dress. I don't know, y'all. I guess it's a dress. It's cute. It's cute. It's by Veronica M. I, that's I, She sent me quite a few things with that label. Uh, this is by London Times. It's a sleeveless, cute little summery dress. <laughs> Let's be very honest. Other than the shacket and one of the sweaters, that little cream color sweater was real pretty. Not really feeling it, but I will try to reserve judgment until I've done the try on. So here we go. All right, y'all gonna have to make it make sense. First of all, it's a little snug. It's making me very boobalicious. And um, no, um, it's $118. It's by London Times. Next. Okay, this one is better. <laughs> it's definitely more my taste. But y'all, I I gave her I gave her specific things. You know what I mean when she called. And one of the things that I stressed really strong is I don't like things fitted. Not right now. Probably not ever, you know? <sighs> All right, this <laughs> Y'all, this dress is by Veronica M. It's a sweatshirt dress. Um, for $70. It, yeah, it's very fitted. Um, no. So far, they're batting two for two and not in a good way. Okay, this little top, you guys, is by Velvet Heart. It's called the Riley Shirt. It's $88. And it's really cute, y'all. It's really cute, but, um, I don't need it. I've got one almost identical. These pants were really cute. They were just too small. I couldn't pull them up over my hips. <laughs> just being honest, but they are cute. They're by Bishop and Young. Uh, they've got pockets. They've got a pleat down the, like a seam down the middle front. And so they're really cute. They're called paper bag pants. They're called paper bag pants, but they just did not work for me. Um, they're $95. And now let me try on that sweater. Okay, this is actually really, really pretty. Uh, it's very, very soft. It's cotton nylon, hang on. It's a cotton nylon silk blend. And she actually talked to me about this sweater on the phone. And, and I agree, it's a lovely sweater. Uh, I love this color and it's actually super, super soft. It's also $120. So I love it. I like it a lot. I just don't like it $120 worth. All right, we're gonna keep going. I have on the kind of corduroy joggers and the Michael Stars top. Uh, the Michael Stars top is way too big. I, I thought it was. It, it looked like it was going to be too big. Um, the Michael Stars top is the Chiara High Low top in stucco gray for $98. Then these pants are by Velvet Heart. The Leanna Crop Cargo in Thundercloud for $78. A lot of fabric right here. I'm just not, I don't, I don't like these at all. Um, I don't like the way they fit. They're just not my style. They're just not my style. All right, I'm going to try on that little blue top. All right, I'm going to put it on with my jeans. It looks ridiculous with these pants. Hold on. Okay, this I actually like. Um, it's very, very soft. I love the color. Um, I like the fit. You know, it does come around the tummy, but I think it's done in a flattering way. Um, so let me see how much it is, because it is pretty. I do like this. All right, this is by Veronica M. It's called the Dolman Banded Top Asia Washed 
for $59. That's cute. I mean, it's really not. I don't know that I like it well enough to drop $60 on a top, but um, it is pretty. I would say so far, I like this the best. Okay, I have on the jeans. These are not your daughter, not your daughter's jeans. That's the brand. They're boot cut and they're way too long, way, way too long. They're black. Uh, they're actually very comfortable, but they're way too long. They are, they're the Barbara boot cut in black for $99. All right, this top is an olive and it's really pretty, you guys. Um, ah, you know, I just don't know how I feel about the crossover thing. I think it's really pretty. I, I love the color and it, it really is pretty. I might, I, I might play with this one in my wardrobe a little bit because I do like this color. Um, it is by, it's called the uh, Surplice uh, Cupro Top in Olive for $76. I don't know, you guys. I don't know if I like it that much. It's cute, though. It really is. All right. The last thing, the shacket and that brown top. I think I'm going to put my jeans back on for that. Okay, y'all, this top is really cute. It's, it's really a lot shorter than what I would like. I would much prefer it down here, but it's not terrible. It's not terrible in the length. Um, I love the color. The sleeves are cute. I like the little tie detail. This is really cute, y'all. I kind of actually really like this. You know, I think it would be really cute with um, skirts too. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm kind of, I'm kind of, I don't remember the price. So let's just check the price though. It's by Gentle Fawn. It's called the Maya Top and Coffee. Oh, it's $88, y'all. <laughs> it's $88. I don't know about all that. All right, let me put on the shacket that she sent with it. We know I'm going to love this. Ooh, that, <laughs> that is very soft. Very, very soft. It's pretty big. I would size down in this, it's too big. Jackets are kind of oversized, so I definitely would have needed a medium in this. Um, I am kind of <laughs> in between mediums and larges. I can wear some mediums, some things I have to wear a large in, so that's not that's not her fault. She sent me, you know, that that's fine. But a jacket is oversized, so I would definitely have gone down a size in this, for sure. But yeah, it is really cute though, y'all. It is. It's really cute. Okay, let me see the price. The Easton Shacket and Balsam for $76. That's not a bad price for that at all. Okay, so the things that I liked in this box. Okay, I've got five things that I actually like. So, five pieces. If you keep five pieces, you do get um, $20 towards your next purchase. Um, so, all right, let me add this up and see where we're at. Okay. <laughs> All right, I added them up. All right, um, the five pieces. I like this little brown top. I like this jacket. I loved this sweater. I thought this green olive was really pretty. And um, I thought this was nice, this blue. If I kept all five pieces, it would be right at $500 before tax. It's like $4.96 before tax. And I would get $20 off my next box for doing that. <laughs> So no, <laughs> absolutely not. Okay, so maybe I can just keep one thing out of this box, but honestly, I don't need to because I'm not losing a styling fee or anything like that. That is the really good thing. There's no risk. So this was really not a good fit for me as far as the things that I liked. I didn't love them. You know what I'm saying? It's like, Y'all know me, I've, kn I've been known to drop a little bit of money if it's something that I love, love, love and think I'm gonna wear a lot of. But I don't think there was anything there that honestly, I would wanna give up something out of my closet. Let's put it that way. So this is what I'm gonna do, y'all. I'm gonna send it all back. I'm gonna thank them very much and I'm gonna move on. I don't think front door fashion is for me. I don't think we're a right fit in the style so much. It's just not the best discount structure. Um, it is fun to get quite a few clothes and I do like the hang up bag and all that kind of thing. That That's kind of neat, makes it special. But I don't think this is a real good fit for me. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Is it something y'all enjoy? Y'all just want me to keep doing, you know, cause you like to see all the different clothes. You think I ought to give it another try maybe after the new year 
or just do it like special occasions, y'all let me know because I, I don't want to count them completely out. They're both stylists that I talked to on the phone were super sweet, so sweet. They were so nice, um, you know, and the service is super fast. I'll tell you that. I I placed a request for this box and got it in like three days. Now, that is because I'm in Texas, so it is quick shipping. But anyway, y'all give me some feedback. Tell me what you think. But in this box, I think I'm just going to send it all back. All right, guys. Y'all have a great blessed day. And until we get back together again, you guys stay safe. You stay well. And I'm out. Mm -hmm.